Oh, shit. The nigga live. I was trying to go live, but okay. Hey, here we are. Fuck it. Welcome back. You know who will be? It's your boy, Covillain, representing GameCircuit.com. So today, you can play some more Yu-Gi-Oh, bro. So the KC Cup is over. And I definitely want to talk about that. But hold on. Before we do, let me get the link shared for anybody who wants to wants to join. But the KC Cup, man, you can't take it you can't take it too serious. Because if you take that KC Cup too serious, then you can end up not enjoying the game. And I, I won't lie, when the game first came out, I actually took the, the KC Cup really serious. Okay, I think that's good enough. Yeah, like I, I took this uh this Yu-Gi-Oh thing like super, super serious. And every time I didn't do good in the in the KC Cup, I would I'd get mad. I I'd, I'd get mad at fucking like I wouldn't say like flip out or whatnot, you know what I mean? But I question like my gaming skills. I'm like, fuck man, like I can't make it to the second round. Am I am I just not good enough? Um You know what I mean? Like I really started questioning like my gaming skills and I realized that I wasn't having fun. Like the whole point of, of video games is is to have fun, and of course there's a competitive side that's actually fun too. But when that takes over the overall enjoyment of playing video games, then you gotta you gotta really re reconsider um, the game you're playing and why you're playing it. Hold on. If I can spell. So hold up. I gotta I gotta find me an image I can use real quick. There we go. So again, back to the Back to the not taking video games too too serious. I know there's some people that that do, and I'm not gonna lie. If there is there's a part of me I like competitive video games. That's that's why I play I play fighting games. And so there's there's a certain amount of enjoyment you get from almost done um, from beating up on your opponent I wonder if this play playlist is gonna play for a long time I right, well can I make that what is this Beat off okay all right So, what are we going to do today in Yu-Gi-Oh? Well, I definitely want to work on some new decks. I definitely need to get some gems. 
So here's what we're going to do. We're just going to duel some standard duelists, and we're going to chit-chat for a little bit, and then I'm going to try to rack up some gems, and then buy some cards, and then build a deck, and then see how it goes. Alright, so... But I do have some topics to talk about. So, while we're while we are dueling these standard duelists, we will definitely talk about some stuff. So, yo, I'm definitely in the mood for a duel. Thanks to the yen. This argument Let's has 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 been a lot, but um, Here I go. fast food chains. My what are, what are the top five fast food chains, or your top five? I'll just I'll just say it at that. Your 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 top your top <laughs> your top five fast food. Say that say that fast five times. <laughs> so yeah, leave me some comments. Let me know what your what your uh, top five food your top <laughs> your top five fast food chains. <laughs> So I'll give you mine. So the first one, I would definitely have to say for me, hold on. Not in and out. Yes, we did have in and out tonight, but uh, no, not not in and out. In, so for me, actually. Would it have to be uh, first one, <clears throat> Jack in the Box. I'm like a Jack in the Box fan. I mean, I'll I'll go to Jack in the Box like four four times a week. But here's the thing: we got a Jack in the Box like right down the street from us, and I hardly ever go because the fam is you know they they they're not Jack in the Box fans, but I I, I like Jack in the Box. And then there is. Um, another restaurant um, it's probably just like a local chain but it's called farmer boys and it's basically like a like a pit stop that's in Oceanside so if you're not not from Oceanside you're not from the from the West Coast so pit stop is basically like a it's a burger burger joint So it's a, it's a burger joint and it's it's actually it's actually really good. So yeah, so it was uh, Carl's or Jack the Box, Crumb uh, Boys, Carl's Jr. Right, gotta gotta hit a Carl's Carl's Jr. And then um, I can I can get with Jersey Mike's. Right, so Jersey Mike's, and then what's what's the the last one? Um, oh, oh yeah, Taco Shop, homie. Motherfucking Taco Shop, and not in that order either. Like I'm just spitting off what I like. So it's not it's not in any any particular order. So you got Jack in the Box, you got Farmer's Boy, which is basically like like a burger joint, it's just like pit stop. Then you got Carl's Jr. Right, Carl's Jr. And then um, I said the Mexican restaurants. And what the hell else did I say? Damn. I have to get old, get shit. But anyways, so that's my that's my top fast food restaurants. Yo, but leave me some comments. Let me know. Let me know your, your top five. <clears throat> So 
hey, the talk taco shop be banging when you're out clubbing, when you come home, you know what I'm saying? Like after the club, taco shop. Some people like to hit up Denny's, IHOP, whatnot. I'm like, nah, bro. I got to hit those taco shops. Got to get that burrito so you can soak up all that alcohol. But, um, yeah, the taco shop is, is definitely up there. Here's the thing. You got to go to the to the right taco shop, too. Because there, there are some taco shops where they don't got any flavor in their food. And I'm like, ugh. So the one we go to... I go to top notch taco shop. Got to be a uh, Primos. Now I know there's I know there is there, there's a couple of couple of ones in in Oceanside, um, but I haven't ate at ate, I haven't eaten there in a in a couple years, so I forget which ones are, are good. But out here it's Primos, and then they they actually have they actually have a. Um, a taco shop right down the street and I forget what it's called I think it's called like Tijuana or something like that and my girl's been wanting to try it she's been like oh we gotta try it because every time I every time we um, um, see the spot it's always, it's always popping and people are always there like it's always busy so I'm like okay that, that that's a good sign but me, I'm just kind of, I'm kind of skeptical, homie. I'm not going to lie. I'm kind of skeptical on, on trying new restaurants. Especially since I've had uh, food poisoning more than once, more than twice. I want to say like maybe like four or five times. Um, so <clears throat> I'd be kind of weary about trying, trying new shit. And in food in general, if I even think that there's something wrong with the food, you know what I mean? Um, it doesn't taste right, smells funny, doesn't look right, whatnot. And I mean, it can it can just be like the littlest thing. I'm like, no, I'm not eating it. I'm not eating it. I, I I think I've had food poisoning that much to where I'm just like I'm very skeptical on my food, and I tend to go to places that I have a good experience at and and trust versus trying trying new shit. So. All right, so let's see how many, um, let's see how many, I think it's dice that we use to play play that game, whatever game that it is. Really? Are we, are we, are we going to error out here? And you know what? This is shit that makes me mad about this game. So this, this shit right here, no network connection detected. My stream didn't drop off, did it? Everything seems fine from my end. This is this is the shit that I'm talking about. I mean, I can check my internet right now. Can I go to YouTube? Yeah, here, let me show you. I'm on YouTube. I can click on a Look, hey, that 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 works, right? Do you do you see what I'm saying? So it's this it's this goddamn game. And honestly, if they don't care enough to fix it, like why do we even play the game anymore? Like that that's another thing I want to talk about. So us us as gamers, we have power over the video games that we play and the companies. Let's reboot this. Can't even fucking reboot. Plastic. Hey, please, please fucking clip this some some shape, way, form, or fashion and, and share this. Share it with fucking Konami and let them know, like, hey, this is what the fuck your game does. Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Links! 
You have a suspended dual pass in progress? Wait, what? Oh, oh okay. Alright, anyway, so we as we as consumers, right? We as consumers. We have power over over the companies. Because basically the companies make the products for us. And the best way to send a message to any company is to stop supporting their product. Because I don't I don't care what you say. If a company has no money, they can't function. Plain and simple. So I think I think if we really want Konami to start fixing issues with like video games or just developers just in general, A, I think we need to voice our opinion. And B, if they don't take us serious, I think we just we stop supporting the fucking game. Cause at the end of the day, what what are they gonna say? Well, they're not they're not supporting the game anymore. We're gonna force them to support it. Yeah, you're gonna force me to buy Yu-Gi-Oh cards. But here's 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 the thing with that. You could run into an issue when the developer says, you know what? Oh, we we really don't care because we're making money elsewhere. And so this is just a drop in the bucket for us, so we're not gonna even attempt to fuck with the game anymore. Like no no extra decks, no nothing like this is what you get, have a nice day, fuck out of here. I mean they could. If we if we push back, I mean they could. But the likelihood is no because they see the potential to, to make money off of bettering the game. Like, if the community is actually crying about the fucking disconnect issues that are going on in this goddamn game, then obviously the fans want the game to function correctly so they can play and have a... so they can have a enjoyable experience which will in turn allow them to support the game. But this right here is bullshit. There is no reason why this game should be doing this. And I think it's because lazy people don't want to fix it. They don't want to put the time in or don't want to put the energy in. And they could have fixed this in the beginning when they knew it was an issue and people were fucking emailing and leaving comments saying, hey, and then what they do, they just covered it up by saying, you need to get a better network connection. Yeah, like I couldn't believe when I, when I emailed uh, Konami and I was like, hey, your game, your game has a, has a disconnect issue, bro. And they were like, um, Wow. They were like, no, you just need a uh, better Wi-Fi. And I was like, better Wi-Fi? I'm using Ethernet cord. Uh, excuse me? And so I replied back, I was like, I'm using an Ethernet cord. And they still reply back, you need to check your signal, make sure your signal is, is strong. I was like, wow. Wow. Actually, can I resume it? Maybe... Maybe I should have just ended this one.
but yeah, I mean, if we as gamers started started like uniting and not letting you know them get away with giving out sloppy games, then then we would have a, a lot more better games. <laughs> Definitely. All right. Let's get up in here real quick. Let's roll the dice a couple times. So I think we got 103 dice fragments. Oh, come on. Are you kidding? Look, do you see this shit? Here. Stream is good. Not dropping any not dropping any fucking frames. Like I I don't I don't understand what's going on. I do not understand what's going on. So just imagine if I was playing ranked matches right now. I would be having all these losses because disconnection issues. My wireless signal isn't as strong, but I'm playing on Ethernet. Bro, are you fucking for real? Okay, here, here's, here's what I'm going to do. Hold on. Because clearly we got something going on with fucking Yu-Gi-Oh. All right, let me just relaunch the ship. Yeah, we we definitely got some got some issues going on right now, bro. Uh, let's say. So what's up with the game? Y'all, y'all, y'all see this, right? I mean, it says no network or can't detect the the network, but I mean, my my stream is still going. It hasn't dropped out. I mean, I'm stream. I am streaming live right now. So wouldn't you think like if that was the case, then there'd be something going on with my stream also? No network connection detected. Wow. This is this is fucking super super interesting. So I'm gonna tag Konami in this and let them know that this is the experience that people are having with this game. Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Links. Yeah, I I am definitely definitely going to tag Konami in this. All right. Take the hard road. Sure. Use the shooting star deck. So there's been a lot of a lot of new cards in Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Links in the last past couple months. And honestly, I don't know what three quarters of you do. I really don't. 
I mean, maybe I should figure out. Maybe I should start spending spending a little bit money, a little bit of money on on Yu-Gi-Oh, so I can get these decks. Nice. But I don't know. Hey, how much money do you guys spend on this on this Yu-Gi-Oh game? So. I used to actually set aside like 20 bucks out of my paycheck, so it was like $40 a month. That I would, you know, every two weeks I would grab 20 bucks or grab my card, put 20 bucks um, on Steam. And I'm like, all right, yo, hey, we just gotta fucking put 20 bucks on and buy some cards. So I was spending about 40 bucks a month. I, I won't lie, 40 bucks. And I was doing that for about, about four months. Yeah, four, four or five months. And the only reason why I stopped is because I knew it wasn't gonna end. Like, I was spending my 40 bucks in the hopes of getting a majority of the cards and being able to uh, play competitively and, you know, en enjoy my Yu-Gi-Oh! experience. But I realized, like, after the fifth or sixth month that I was like, this is never going to stop because they've been releasing a new deck or a new pack each, uh, each month. And I was like... And you're gonna continue to buy cards and buy cards. This is like a never, never ending thing. And what makes it bad is that a lot of times the new um, packs that they release, the it changes the the meta game. So your deck that you thought was good and was was doing damage and you know was getting you high ranking is now it's now trash. Essentially. So that's when I realized I was like, yo, this is going to be like a never ending battle. Because I was. I was into Yu Gi Oh! You know what I mean? But I wasn't like how some people are like, yo, we play this every day. You know what I mean? When the new packs come out, we spend all of our money trying to get the. Uh, trying to get all the cards and you know figure out how, how shit works. I mean I was into it, but I wasn't I wasn't that into it. But once I realized that this was going to be a never ending battle, I stopped putting my twenty bucks in. Or stopped stop putting my forty bucks in a month. For future games, if you want developers to fix the game, you, you gotta get loud, me until you and then you have to all band together just in case they don't want to fix it, to have them lose some money, 
so they start so they will start taking the demands of the masses serious I draw can I auto do this yeah you know what and I, I think that's super important because as games get more complex and uh, coding gets um, detailed you want to have a good gaming experience and you don't want to basically end up playing trash what was it like cyberpunk 2020 or whatever remember when that game first came out oh my god dude that was like that was bad just super super bad but I heard that they they got a majority of the, of the bugs fixed but there's still some there's still some bugs but not like it was in the beginning like it was it was fucking bad it's a, again lazy developers and coding well I can't even say like you know lazy lazy coding but you, you can't you can't let companies get away with, with, with stuff like that especially if we if you um, like the game like I genuinely think that Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Links is one of the best uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! games by far I think it might be the best in the series of Yu-Gi-Oh! games that I played but that disconnect issue can definitely take away from the experience and having a good time with the game Ooh, lottery yeah but this is when we we would need to like bond together to you know, let Konami know, like, hey, it's not okay to, to leave the game and, and have these type of issues. Not, not now. Not when... Not when your game depends on the internet. And fighting games are coming a long way also. Um, the fighting game community is demanding better experience online when it comes to, comes to video games. When it comes to um, you know player versus player matches, and so with that, Check this out. Oh, hold on, I don't want to use the harpy's deck. I think I'll work on work on this deck. So they're demanding a better experience and voicing their opinion and I think for the most part the companies the companies are hearing them and they're making sure that the, the online experience is a is a good one and the um, the games coming out uh, in a in the near future a lot of them said that there's gonna be rollback net code which is supposed to be really good for fighting games so you think you I'll duel you. duel Feeling Yes, nervous. it's all about um It's my turn. It's all about voicing your opinion. My monster's effect activates. Oh, um, let's see. Let's see how you 
My field spell activates. I'm, I might be able to pull this match off. It dep just depends on what, what happens out. next. I summon a monster in attack position. My monster's effect activates. And then we'll let him Check go through his whole. Well, I, I don't want to say let him, but can't stop him. So we'll let him go activates. through his his whole um, I fusion series of fusion summons. My monster's effect activates. From my hand, I activate yep, we'll a get continuous to pull two spell. Cards. Let's battle. Let's see you get past this. I attack with my Switch monster. To defense. My monster's effect activates. Ah, I activate a continuous spell. I end my turn. Feeling okay. nervous? It's draw. Let's see what we get here. My turn. I draw. My field spell activates. Oh, nice. I know just what I need. My monster's effect activates. All right. Yep. He got, he got that one. He got that one. Hold on. Let me see if it was. I have two triple D decks. I think that other one just might have been the one I was playing with trying to trying to rearrange some stuff. Let me try this one out. You can def time to duel. duel. All right, my turn. Oh yeah, and then what is my my special power? Setting the call. <laughs> Feeling and nervous. My turn. Draw. Field card is supposed to be okay, all right. My monster's effect activates. You really think that'll work? I flip over my face down card. My continuous trap activates. This'll be perfect. getting in there. I was getting in them guts. I like it. I like it. Okay, so it's the Harpy's Hunting Ground, but... There's a condition for that. Okay, can only be used at the beginning of the main phase of your first turn. Return one card 
from your hand to your deck and then place one harpy's hunting ground to your field zone from your deck if you control a field spell replace it or yeah place it in the graveyard okay interesting I don't know why Harpy's Hunting Ground isn't working? Maybe because I have to have... Oh, okay. I, 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 I think I know. I think I know, because I don't even actually have the Harpy's field card. Okay, I get it. I was assuming that it would be added to your deck. Okay, that that's what the problem is. Alright, so let's search for another good another good option. Level four or lower from your deck. Alright, so then that would mean either one of these cards. Oh actually that, that that might work. That might work. <clears throat> that might work, my friends. So yo, I saw on the news today that uh, they're getting rid of the, the mask mandate for, for like airplanes and j just in general. And I'm like, hey, I, I think Yugi, I, may admire I think wearing a mask should have been optional, My, regardless. No for me. But I get how making it mandatory, trying to protect the public from from its own self. You, like I, I, I totally get it. So they're gonna eliminate mask mandates, and things are pretty much um, going back to the way the way things work. And then at this point, if people decide to get vaccinated or not, I mean it's it's totally up to them. But for me, I mean, I got vaccinated and got boosted. All that great stuff because um, I did not. Which one should I take? I'll take that one. Because uh, I didn't want to suffer the consequences of having a severe COVID sickness if I didn't get um if I didn't get vaccinated. Oh look at you, bastard. My monster's effect activates. Alright. I count you, darling. I fusion summon a monster. Um. Ready to battle? You're going down. 
Wow, bastard. I'm, I, I totally messed that up. That was a that was a good play. I wasn't expecting that. This is actually a really good card. Fortress Warrior is, is actually a really good card. I'm actually gonna come up with it with a deck that focuses just on the, the Fortress Fortress Warrior. Because if you can get a couple cards on the field, this card can become invincible. So you have to attack it twice for it to be destroyed. Um, but if I believe, I forgot the equip card, but there's an equip card that you can put that actually puts a counter on the monster and any time it would be destroyed you just move a counter. So then it becomes indestructible at that point. Because the first attack is not going to go through, and if your opponent can attack multiple times, you can put multiple counters on it and then remove it. So then, at that part, uh, um, at that at that point, sorry, you just really need to protect it from being targeted um, from cards, and it can literally become an invincible card. So I'm I'm actually going to work on that. I, I got a, I got a couple ideas. All right, so clearly this guy is thinking, what what the hell can I do? Doesn't look like you can do much, bro. I Doesn't look like you can do much. Okay, all right, set set those cards face That's down. The okay. All right. How naive to think that you can beat me. <laughs> I draw. Yeah. Get that out of here. Get that out of here, son. Ready to battle? Dunny boy. Go! Mm. With the big 28. That's what I'm talking about. We get in the guts. I may have lost, but I have no regrets. For it was... Huh. Yeah, homie, I ain't got no regrets. Alright, I'm at least duel until I get all the, the gems. So I think there's like two more spots for, for gems, so yo, we definitely gonna play it in game and get the gems. We got it. can defeat me don't flatter yourself well now let's duel feeling nervous it's my turn from my hand i activate a, I activate a continuous spell okay well i already have one of those My monster's effect activates. Okay, let's do this. Let's do this. It's come. Huh. Oh, wow. <laughs> wow. He didn't want to see none of that action. Wow. He was like, nah, I don't want no parts in that. I'm like, okay, all right, bro. Hey, I mean, no, no parts. I'm like, okay, hey, I'm good. I'm good with that. Stay out of my way. Let me do my thing. Okay. So, but back to the mask thing. I'm like, hey. If you don't want to wear a mask, don't wear a mask. If you don't want to get vaccinated, I'm cool with that. Don't, don't fucking get vaccinated. I, I don't care. 
At the end of the day, you are the one who has to deal with the fucking consequences. And as long as you're okay dealing with them, then I don't care. And, and honestly, that's the way it should have okay. been the whole time during this pandemic. My and I was even telling telling my girl, the U.S. government should have been like, effect. Hey, if the hospitals are all packed and you guys get COVID, you guys want to take the precautions? From my head, I'm sorry. I like, that's, that's, that, that's the way it is. Because there were, there were some people turn. who were like, Here I go. you know, I don't want to wear a mask. I don't want to get vaccinated. And I don't think you. I don't think you should force people to get get vaccinated. Like honestly, vaccination is for protecting yourself against really bad diseases. And if you don't want to do that, that's that's totally fine. But we don't want to hear you whine about the consequences. Like if you don't want to get the vaccination for mumps and measles, first of all, we we don't want to hear you complain that you're sick. Okay, well. If you would have got vaccinated, it would have been different. But since you didn't, that that's what happens. And then second, it's 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 each individual's right. As long as you're willing to deal with the consequences, then that that's really about it. All that shit off the board. Oh boy. My monster's effect activates. I wonder if... Let's see. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, I could do that. Yeah, I, I totally, I totally screwed this up. From my hand, I activate a field cloud. Set a call. I end my Feeling turn. Feeling nervous? It's wrong. So it depends on what we get in our hand next, but I don't think I'm winning this one. Battle! Get ready! 
Attack! I activate a continuous trap. I activate a continuous trap. Come out! I spec your grid! My How turn do I turn to this duel around? My turn. Check this. Ah, uh, I draw. <laughs> wow, yeah. Uh, no. Yeah, but that was that was that was totally my fault, though. But anyways. So I mean, hey, if you if you motherfuckers don't want to get vaccinated, I I really don't care. Because COVID, just think about it, COVID deaths is about to reach a million. That means a million motherfuckers died in the U.S. alone from fucking COVID. If you want to, if you want to go that route and, 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 and be with the list of motherfuckers who, who could potentially die, by all means, be my guest. I don't care. Feeling nervous? It's my monster's effect activates. Yeah, this is... I fusion summon a monster. I set a card face down. I set a card. Hey, but don't be, don't don't go whining to nobody when you get sick. That that's it. Like don't don't go whining about how you're sick and you gotta go to the hospital. This like I kept hearing stories about um, people who didn't want to get vaccinated and then ended up getting sick, have to have to be hospitalized, and then they were begging the doctors the for the vaccine. They were like, Can you please, please give me the vaccine. The doctor was like, it's fucking too late, bro. The vaccine was 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 uh, supposed to help prevent serious illness. Like in your case, it's already too late, bro. And I know, a, I know, I need a couple people died from from that, from just I don't want to get vaccinated, and then you know begging for the for the vaccination. A cold flame that woulda, shoulda, coulda, but you didn't. Sometimes it happens like that, bro. And Black Rose Dragon's effect activates. Oh, Black Rose Gale. Oh my god. From my oh, dude, I so... I forgot I had this off. I was like, why didn't that activate? Okay. I special summon a month. I set a card. I'm not scared to attack. Yeah, that... I go. I this toggle button sometimes... Fucking it's screws still... me. Let's see what you can do. I can't believe this I is happening. Uh, check this. Uh, I draw. Okay. Not too. This... All right, I gotta stop making so many fucking mental mistakes. That that, that was a mental mistake on my part. Uh, I totally left the toggle on off. Well, actually, I thought he was going to go through, like, his whole shooting star phase. And then when, once he had got to, like, the shooting star dragon, I was going to enable it so I could use my, my quick play card. But I got distracted. You think duel. Feeling nervous? It's my turn. All right, let's let's see what we get here. Hey yo, hey, and I just saw an article today talking about weed. I was like, bro, hey, yeah, let me, let me talk about this. Let me fucking talk about this. So when I was a kid, right? So I'm in my forties. When I was a kid, 16, 17, 18, weed wasn't legal. 
and you have to know you have to know people. You know what I'm saying? Like you have to know people who knew people to get the weed. And it wasn't like how it is now. You can go into a dispensary. You could be like, "Hey, yo, let me get the good shit." Da da da. Like you just got whatever the weed man had. Like if that nigga had bunk shit, then you would just go buy bunk shit. You know what I'm saying? You would you would complain there. Like, all right, this nigga weed weed is trash, but you know what I'm saying? It is what it is. And then just just have to buy that stash up, and when he gets a new stash, hope it's better than the last one. So the article was talking about how weed is is super super strong. And a lot of people underestimate weed and its effect on the on the mind and the body and uh, what can happen. And that's very true. Because again, when I was a teenager, weed wasn't, it's not as strong as it is now. You know what I'm saying? Motherfuckers making like shit 70, 80% THC. Like, we just had some rigmarole dirt mechs. We call it mechs because it's from Mexico. And that was that was good enough for the for the most part. Every now and then we run into some like some chronic, some chocolate tie, you know what I'm saying? Some some crystally reddish stuff. Um, but for the most part, it was it was that mix, bro. It was that what you got? Uh, got mix. So now that weed is legal and basically they're they're up in the THC count, motherfuckers are starting to find out that weed is not no joke. It is it is no joke, especially edibles. You, you, you got to be careful. You got to be careful with the fucking edibles. And so I, I learned my lesson, and thank God it was only just just a small lesson. But after that, I was like, oh, okay, definitely got to be careful. You definitely want to start off with a low dose. Well, let 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 let's reverse it. If you don't know what you're doing, don't don't take anybody's edibles. Okay. Can we get this? Can we get this? Come on out! I special summon a monster. Okay. I synchro summon a monster. I set a card. Okay, so don't don't take anybody's edibles that they made at home or whatnot because you don't know the dosage, you don't know exactly what's going on. I would go to the dispensary so you know the, the THC levels. And I would get the lowest the lowest dose and then work your way up from there. So you don't have like a fucking a, a bad experience. The, the one thing that Come on out. The one thing that will make a per a person uneasy is having a really bad experience on, on on a drug or something they 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 did you know the first couple of times. Now, if you're OG and you've been you know smoking for a while and and you're good, then do what you do. Hold on, what the fuck are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? Let's battle! Okay! Direct attack! I don't think so! I activate my face down card! I activate a quick play spell! Here goes! I tap you directly! Brings it's my turn to an end. I can't believe this is happening. Uh, I'll take that. I draw. 
My monster's effect activates. We'll see about that. I flip over my set card. I activate a trap. I know what to do. I special summon a monster. So yeah, Make you want move. to my turn. just be careful with the uh, with the edibles. Because the last thing you want is to have a, a very bad experience, and it it is all mental. And what what I mean by that? Because some people would be like, "Well, I don't smoke weed, so I don't understand." So to me, what weed does is it opens your mind up to can't wait to see what you other do. thoughts I end my turn Ugh, I can't believe this is happening uh, I draw. Uh, my yeah. get that shit out of there and then all of a sudden nope 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 actually can you do this my monster's yeah. effect activates I'm counting on you, darling. Are you ready to battle? Okay, this it doesn't have pierce, damn. You're going down. <laughs> so so weed opens you up to receive Always different thoughts. Let's, let's, let's just lose. put it like that. So That's anybody who smokes motto. weed knows what the fuck I'm You're talking about. Because there's some things that float through your head that you normally wouldn't be thinking if you were sober. And that's how you know. That's how you know you're high. So some of these thoughts could be good. Some of these thoughts could be bad. And... When the when the thoughts get really bad, it's not like you can turn it off per se because you're under the influence of, of weed. So you have to wait for it to wear off. So it can be a very uncomfortable experience where you feel like where you feel like the thoughts are not yours. And and, and technically I don't want to get into this whole esoteric shit, but I mean, technically they're not, they're, they're not yours. You're just picking up on I'm ready to show you other frequencies, could be pick, picking up I on like fucking other realities, fucking who knows, eyes. who knows. But I feel like weed opens you up to the receive a different information that you Duel. wouldn't, you wouldn't necessarily Feeling receive nervous? if you were it's sober. My turn. So that could be alarming for some my people. Let's... Okay, hold on, let me think about this. Okay, so I'm gonna do this, right? So again, I mean, you, you just want to be careful because you don't want to end up. And this and this is what we call having a bad trip. From my hand, I activate a spell. Really? You'll enjoy this. I summon a. I set a card. 
so... Let's battle. You're not ah, I have plenty of duel left in me. My turn Here is I go. Over. Okay, hold on, hold on. My turn. Might be able to get this. Bad experience by taking taking too much edibles, smoking too much weed. Ready to battle? Go! My monster Not attacks. So My monster's effect activates. And your opponent declares an attack. The bomb is discarding your opponent's card cluster. You can activate this effect during the battle phase. Destroy the opponent's monster after, after battle calculation. I reveal my face down card. I uh, activate a quick play spell. Ah! It still isn't. Huh. My I turn will is destroy over. You. Make your move. My turn. <laughs> I draw. Battle. Really? So it works both Go. ways? My my monsters are back. Ah! Like that's hmm. gonna keep me down. Nothing I can't handle. Hmm. My turn is How done. Do I turn this As duel will around. you be? My turn. You never. Ah! Uh, I draw. I hope you're ready. I summon up. Let's battle. Show us the power. I attack your life points directly. I don't think so. My turn. <laughs> I will prolong. So yeah, just just be careful Make with with uh, <laughs> weed. Like I know draw. the THC levels. My turn is done. And don't be. As will you be. Don't be, if I'll you don't smoke blunts. Do, don't. I draw. Don't smoke blood. I hope you're ready. I summon a monster in attack position. My monster's effect activates. Okay. I see summon a monster. Ready to battle? Show of the power. I attack your life points directly. I don't think so. My monsters are back after the I will prolong My turn is your suffering. Yeah, because I've I've known some people turn. to <laughs> I draw consume a large amount of a marijuana there and have My a turn is done, as will you be have a bad experience. How do I turn this duel around. Uh, I draw. Okay, let, let, let me see. Let me see if I can get this. Hold on. Here's my face down card. Okay, that's my baby. My continuous trap activates. I activate a continuous spell. I'm counting on you, darling. My monster's effect activates. Oh, it's okay. It needs to be seven, seven, seven. Um, come on out. I special summon a monster. Damn it. 
I totally, I totally messed it up. Yep, that, that's gonna get wrapped. Yeah, I, I, I messed that up. But yo, man, there's, there's all sorts of ways you can, you can like smoke weed now, bro. And before it was like, it was either out of out of an aluminum can, that was like, if you didn't have anything else. But joint, bong, a blunt. A blunt was like if you were like uh, OG. You think you can defeat me? Don't uh, Very rarely did I, I never did I did I smoke out of blunts. So I was like, oh, that, careful, that's, you that's for the OG people. I sense our opponent is no ordinary. I usually take like one or two hits. Duel. I'm like, I'm good. Might. But yeah, now they got now they got um, THC oil, vape cartridges. Um, what is that other shit where you get blowtorch? Whatever the hell that's called. I'm like, bro, man, y'all y'all motherfuckers are doing a lot. Definitely take that. Why did you not execute the moves I suggested? Yeah, so I'm fucking dueling, weed is, is Listen, has definitely changed the way you since playing today, I was a kid. There wasn't a single thing you could do to now, stop me. You could just you could just walk in and be like, go to the dispensary, and be like, yo, hey, let me get this, let me get the gummy bear stars. I'm like, damn, time, times are changing. Times are changing. So just just be careful. If you smoke weed, be careful. If you're just starting out, start out small, take small hits. Cause like I said, you don't wanna you don't wanna have a, a bad trip. And so for the for the OG people, like we, we know like hey when we start having like a bad trip or the mindset's not right best thing to do go for a walk go for a walk so your body can process it get it out i actually have some anxiety spray that i use uh, because sometimes it does it does trigger kind of kind of a panic attack you know when you're when you're too high and you know your mind starts like racing and you're like oh my god i gotta get this under control so, um, I do have anxiety spray that works really well. So we have a store called, called Sprouts down here on the on the West Coast, and it's called Rescue Remedy. And I and I I kid you not, whenever whenever I'm having one of those anxious moments, um, like when I'm high and you know shit's just not making sense, um, that Rescue Remedy it works 99.9% of the time. Thing you could do to There's stop only me. like one or two times where it hasn't worked, but I was like in full blown like panic attack, and so at that point I just had to like 
breathe and ride it out. But uh, for the for the most part, uh, that that rescue remedy fucking works. So, and I mean, you ain't got to be high to use it, but if you have a lot of stress or you're like in panic mode because of some crisis that happened. Ten sprays under the tongue. Give it about ten minutes, and it will it will calm you down. It'll make, it'll make you level-headed enough to actually start focusing again. And I actually timed it like for my for my panic attack that that happened when I smoke and I get too high. It I timed it. It takes around ten minutes for me to actually feel better, feel like I'm in control again. You my do. So, I, and you know, it's I'm not gonna lie, I actually, I actually live by that shit too. My field spell activates! I set it, here I go. I summon a monster and my turn is Here done. I go. Okay. See, this sucks. This sucks because. I don't know what that card is. Okay, so you know what? You know what? Let's just put this down. Let's just destroy this. And, and that. So at least we have a safe path onto the board. Yeah. Exactly what I was waiting for. I set a card. Okay, alright, well it's that card. Continuous spell. I activate a continuous spell. Alright, so let's. Yeah, we're gonna have to choose that. My monster's effect activates. Alright, so which. I gotta figure out which monster we wanna put down. Because I already know what's coming. And it's a bunch of bullshit. It literally is. So... Let's see if... This will pay off. I don't think it will. I'm counting on you, Donnie. I usually summon a monster! I don't. I don't think it will. I think I'm. I'm I think I'm gonna be stuck. So I can get a free hit in here. Show him your power. No. He'll activate his, uh, his effect. Yep. By placing two cards on the field. I special summon a monster. I expected you to do that. Oh yeah. My monster's effect activates. You're going down. Okay, just this one. My monster this is now. My field spell activates. See, I, end my I was turn. I was screwed Here either I way. My turn. I draw a card. I set a card. Okay, hold on. It's my lady that bad. My turn is done. Feeling nervous? Okay. It's much draw. I activate a continuous. Ah! Uh, I activate a continuous spell. I 
could do that. So let's let's try that. Let's try that. My monster's effect activates. Let's just switch this to four. Hey yo, Ron Carlos, what's up, man? And then let's just, let's just try to go in. Show them the power. I attack your life points directly. And yeah, let's just go in. My monster attacks your life points directly. My monster's effect activates. And then it's Destiny's draw from him, right? My turn. My turn. Part of the card. Here I go. I summon a monster. My monster's effect activates. Yeah, this is this is gonna suck. This is this is definitely gonna suck, but. Field spell activates. We'll see. We'll see what happens. All right. I oh, special thanks. summon thanks, a monster. Yeah. My monster's effect activates. But I don't, I don't think I'm going to be able to survive this hit. I think what this deck needs I is more is more protection. My trap activates. Here I go. That's what I think. That's what I, I think is going on. If this deck needs more protection. My monster's effect activates. Yep, because this is going to be a wrap. It's going to tribute all all the monsters, and then he has. All right. I exceed. Summon a monster. Oh. Okay. My monster's effect activates. Okay. I'm, I'm cool with that. Yep. All right. I special summon a monster. My monster's effect activates. Yeah, and this is this is why I think this card Let's is. Battle. Let's do this. My monster ah. attacks. I think this card is, is BS because you can use this effect multiple times in one turn. I'm like, you shouldn't. You shouldn't be able to. They should. It should literally be one time per turn. For the simple fact that it's so easy to put the Magnet Warriors in the graveyard. All right, so yeah, so part of what's wrong with this deck, well, this shit first of all. <laughs> let's 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 get that out. And second, we don't really need diffusion. We don't really need to diffuse anything. So I think what we need is just some. Um, Good old fashioned trap cards. That that's what we need. We just need some good old fashioned get your ass busted trap cards. I think if we had some protection. Oh boy, here's the thing also. We gotta be able to snipe the snipe back row. That's what we got to do. We got to be able to snipe the back row also. So, okay, first of all, we don't we don't need polymerization. We don't we don't need that in deck. So, therefore,
and then we can we can have two two cards that that's nice okay all right actually I mean, I don't know if I want to pay for it, but... I gotta get another fucking Mystical Typhoon. Okay, so that, that looks that looks better. That looks better. So at least we have some protection. At least we can go in there and... Try to... Try to do some damage. We say Triple Lima? Every day that I look at you, you are stronger. Nah, I, I, no, I, I wouldn't. I wouldn't say that. You think I'm getting duel? Let's duel. Here I go. I wouldn't say that. From my hand, I activate. I activate a continuous spell. So let's. My monster's effect activates. We'll take that. I hope you're ready. I fusion summon a monster. I set a card is down. So that's I this is pretty good. This is a, this is actually a fairly strong start. I it's my turn. I draw. You know, I think I'm okay at the game. I don't think I suck. But I don't think that I'm necessarily that good either. Okay. I ritual summon a monster. My monster's effect activates. And what do you do? Triple D? <laughs> no, I I, I I don't know how you fuck triple D. Feeling nervous? It's draw. I I'm always getting here? warmed up. Okay. And actually. Let's let's do it like this. I'm counting on you, darling. My monster's effect activates. Ooh. All right, I guess that doesn't make a difference at this point. Okay. I special summon a monster. Okay, 
we just confuse it with the white monster. Actually, I'll go with this. My monster's effect activates. I'm counting on you, darling. Ice, my monster's effect activates. Okay, hold on. Let me let me read this card real quick. Okay, well this card is not a summon. You can triple N, triple D, monster level one. From your deck, don't rain phase that this card is in your green now because it was sent there this turn. You can use a summon one level eight. I'm counting on you, darling. I special summon a monk. Ready to battle? I probably I probably messed that all up. Yeah, I did. I messed it up. That's cool. No worries. Show them your power. My monster attacks. What's he waiting for? What's he waiting for? My monster's effect activates. I end my turn. Here I go. It's okay. my turn. I draw. I activate a ritual spell. I haven't seen this deck before. I'm, I'm quite curious to see how the the inner workings of it. I might go back and look at the video and check it out. But I, yeah, I'm quite quite interested. So we'll we'll see. We'll we'll see. But it seems like it's a deck filled with ritual Someone monsters. I activate a ritual spell. Okay. I ritual summon a monster. Hmm. My monster's effect. Oh, that fucking sucks. That sucks. Time for battle. Take them down. Oh, my monster attacked like my real win. How do I turn this? Really? Door? I end my turn. My turn. Uh. I activate a continuous spell. No matter the odds, how fight I activate a continuous spell. Really? Um Okay. Let's 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 do this. I'm gonna do this. We're going to change this to four. We're going to get this guy on the field. I hope you're ready. I exceed summoning a monster. My monster's effect activates. Summon a monster. I set a card for this deck. Let's battle. End 
end of the road, hon. My is he your shit? <laughs> That's why I'm surprised he didn't take out Alexander. I'm like, why would you? Maybe he was just going for the for the points, but I'm like, why wouldn't you? Why wouldn't you take out Alexander? All right. Uh, I'll, I'll take it. I'll definitely take it. Discard a card. I'm gonna be pissed. I know you'll help me out. I fusion summon a monster. My monster's effect activates. Take to the skies, elemental hero Stratos. Stratos's effect activates. Once per turn, target one face up monster your opponent controls, and one face up your monster you control. Except this card, the opponent's target monster loses attack and defense equal to the attack of the targeted monster until the end of the turn. I set up my turn. Here I go. Okay. My turn draw. From my hand, I activate a continuous spell. Okay, I, I activate that. a continuous spell. Okay. I can get that, so we will put that in our hand. My monster's effect. We will activate. I can make that, and then you can target one for two monster in there. Let me think about this. So I can make that card. Graveyard. I think this is the right way to go. Here now. Come on out! I usually summon a monster. I set a card. I'm counting on you, Dark. My monster's effect activates. Come on out! I special summon a monster. I hope you're ready. I synchro summon a monster. My monster's effect activates. Hold on. Is there anything else I can make? No. I hope you're ready. I special summon a monster. Okay. Ready to battle? Let's be slick about this. Yeah, let me let me think about this. Yeah, we want to do that. Go! My monster attacks! I activate my quick play spell, Form Change! I know you'll help me out. I special summon a monster! 
Um, I don't, I don't really care about that. Okay. Show them your power. I attack with my monster. You gotta do better than that. My monster's effect activates. From my hand, I activate a quick play spell. Show them your power. My monster at your going down. My monster at all you got. This isn't looking good. All I need is a chance. I draw. I'm counting on you, buddy. I summon a monster in attack position. My monster's effect activates. What'd you say? It's two months ago. Um, when you when you met me. Today compares to two months ago when I met you. My monster's effect activates. All right, folks, and this is where I go. we hit him with the trap hole seat, and this is why we put the trap hole in. For this shit right here. Face down. Now, I activate my face down card. My trap activates. I activate my quick play spell. Mask change. Ooh, nice. I know you'll help me out. Okay. I special summon a monster. Time to battle. Take this. A high attack with my, my monster effect activates. Nice. Uh, all I can do is. Uh. Got him. Got him. Got him, son. Got him. I was going up to 60 regardless. I was going up to 6 G's. I was going to summon a monster. Alexander was going to be at 6, six, uh, six G's. I was just going to swing in for it. He knew that. He knew that. Did you say I got that? I got the attitude? <laughs> Hey, yo, on YouTube, my last uh, KC Cup run, it got it got over 500 views. I was like, what? 500 views? Plus? All right, I, I guess people want the Yu-Gi-Oh content, so we got, got to give them some more. But yeah, if you go to the YouTube channel, my last video um, has over 500 views. I was like, yo, that's... That's pretty fucking hype. Actually, let me do this. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll take this. My monster's effect activates. Waiting for a response. Uh-oh, better check that network connection. Check that network connection. Okay, there we go. Listen, hun. Oh. The way you've been playing today, there wasn't a hey, single thing you could do to stop me. People just giving up left and right. I like it. Me. I like it. Yo, hey, check check this out. Check this out. Now, hold on, hold on. Yo, look at that! 800 views, bro. Check that shit out. That's fucking crazy. <laughs> I never had a video fucking 800 or something views, bro. That's what's up. Hey, shout out to everybody watching the video.
dude, that that's a that's a fucking major accomplishment, bro. Like, I don't think I've ever had a had a video get more than maybe like 150 views, bro. We're at we're at 800, 800 right now. That's the business. That's what's up. Why would you do? Yo, if you guys are watching out in like uh, YouTube land, definitely hit the like button. If you're watching on Facebook, definitely hit the like button. Definitely follow. Definitely share. I will be will be providing more content. But I want to thank you guys for watching the fucking videos, man. Like that's the business. I, I I'm just, I'm kind of floored right now. Let's actually, yeah. Let's let's go this route. Come on out! I summon a monster in attack position. I set a card face down. I end my turn. <laughs> it's my turn. I draw. I mean, hey, do you, do you think I'm a, a good duelist? I mean, again, I mean, I, I, I think I'm okay. I, I see other people and I'm just like, wow, like, I wish I could... Not not to say, like, I, I wish I could be like you, but I wish I could spend money on the game like you, because at a certain point, like, you got to spend money on the game to actually um, be, be somewhat competitive. And honestly, I'm just not willing to spend, like... 100 bucks a month on the game. I activate a continuous spell. Ah, I still have I activate a continuous spell. So Okay, so I kind of screwed up earlier, so I'm going to try to fix that. Thanks, man. Thanks for the encouraging, encouraging words there. Yeah, I'll, I'll definitely take that. All right, so this this should be a wrap. But I kind of want to. I feel like I've messed up the, the order of, like, summoning. My monster's effect activates. I hope you're ready. I sub my monster's effect activates. I hope you're ready. I special summon a monster. Four, that's not what I want to do. Summon a monster! 
Hey, well, I'm, I'm glad that, that we met, too. I'm, I'm, I'm glad that we're friends. So the, the feeling is mutual. What I really need to do is I need to fix a lot of these decks. Because there's decks that I... I don't need to play with anymore that I, I should be playing with because I mean they're not completely trash but I just know at a certain point they won't get me to where I want to go there can only do here I go it's my turn I set a monster face down I set a card face down okay. here I, I end go. my turn my turn draw nice from my hand, I activate a quick play spell. Cool. My monster's effect activates. I think this is it. Oh, is, is he not even sticking around? Yeah, I don't even think he's sticking around. I think he's I think he's out of here. He's like, fuck this shit. I've already lost. There we go, Sonny Boy this eight, hey, making him quit on the spot. Making them quit on the spot. And then I forgot the the level mm -hmm. after uh, gold. Isn't it legend? I'm, I'm not. I'm not sure. Oh no! I think it's platinum. Gold, platinum, and then legend, I'm, and yes, then king of games. Looks like it's might. Okay. I usually get to like platinum two or platinum. Star. Three and then let's try to start running into issues. My monster's effect activates. Hey yo, thanks for sharing the stream. This Appreciate it. I special summon a mon Okay. I exceed summon a monster. My monster's effect activates. My monster's effect activates. My monster's effect activates. This card is perfect. I shall set a card. My monster's effect activates. All right, you got a lot of, a lot of effects, man. Let's go. That brings my turn. Feeling to an nervous? End. It's raw. From my hand, I activate a continue. I activate a continuous spell. My set card. I activate my trap card. Okay. Stop right there. My monster's effect activates. Come on out. I summon my monster's effect activates. I hope you're ready. I special summon. 
summon a monster. I'm counting on you, darling. I synchro summon a monster. I set a card face down. Ready to battle? You're going to battle. My monster attacks. Stop right there. My monster's effect activates. Would you say turn. we still have unfinished like business? My turn. Yo, I, draw. I mean, if you wanna, you wanna duel right now. I mean, after this match, I, I'll set up the uh, the players okay. duel, and we can we can duel it out real quick. I summon the monster. I don't think so. I Ooh, reveal my face, face down, down card. face down, my face down activates. always hurts. Face down always hurts. It's wrong. Perfect. My monster's effect activates. Game. Now. Ooh. This is the card I set. I activate my trap card. Now. My monster's effect activates. I'll play this. I special summon a monster. I don't care what you special summon. My monster's effect activates. Okay. I usually summon a monster. Let's battle. Go! Stop right there! My monster's effect activates! Go! My monster attacks your I end my turn. I must find a way to win! My turn! I draw! I'll play this! I summon a monster! My monster's effect activates. I'll play this. I special summon a monster. Get ready! I synchro summon a monster! Nice. My monster's effect activates. Okay. My monster's effect activates. Activates. My monster's effect oh, activates. Really? You can discard one burning abyss card, then target one card. Your opponent this controls or one card in their graveyard shuffle into their deck. If this card is on the field and is destroyed. Time for battle. Take a We can we can play a couple matches and then I'm about to about to end the stream. Um, are you still in the in the chat? Yo, let me know if you're still in the chat and then I'll I'll create the room. If not, then. I would just call it a day for for Yu-Gi-Oh.
I will work on those another time. Okay, all right, yo. I'll wait around for probably like another two minutes or so, but if you don't reply back, then I'll just take it that you're not not in the chat anymore, and then um, yeah, we'll have to play another time. Yeah, I think I'm gonna call it a wrap for for tonight. So, yo, hey, thank you for tuning in. Greatly appreciate it. It's your boy, Covillain, representing GameCircuit.com. If you like the content and you like rocking out with me, do me a favor. Follow me on social media. So that is YouTube, Twitter, Twitch, Facebook, and Discord there. The links should be all in the description below. Click on the links, follow your boy, support. It is greatly appreciated. And I wanna thank you guys for whoever was watching my last KC Cup run, the video got like 800 views, so I take it that you guys are thoroughly enjoying the gaming content, so I will continue to provide you with more Yu-Gi-Oh! content. But again, thank you for tuning in. It's your boy, Cole Villain. I'll catch you guys next time. Deuces.